to have Giano do the Mario 64 120 star run. He is pretty good at Zelda, too. No. <laughs> you might want to try. No. <laughs> if you do it Mario, it'll be amazing. I vote for Mario, for sure. Ah. Giano is amazing. All of these guys have great sense. Hey, Gianna, where are you getting those rubies? Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Oh, wait, did we have a scarecrow song? No. Yeah. Okay. Oh, no. Do whatever you want. Uh, Give me the rubies. Rubies. Didn't want to do it. Yeah, thank goodness. <laughs> Gianna needs three rubies. Oh. Uh, Alright. My rubies. Yeah. There's one, two. Oh, I can't hear. Alright. Uh, I think we gotta move the hat. Cosmo takes the lead. I'll do it with back really in soon. a second here. <laughs> Alright, so we're at the fishing pond, and surprisingly we're gonna get the gold scale because that's how cool this game is. <laughs> so, uh, <laughs> if glitches haven't confused anyone up to this point, you're about to get really, really confused. <laughs> okay, so Cosmo's scaring off some of the other fish to pick out a specific fish here. I believe this one happens to be six pounds. Fishing. How many other has <laughs> Okay, so once Cosmo catches this fish, he's gonna hold Z target and this is gonna glitch the prize into being the gold scale. Just by holding Z target. My fish left. Oh my god. It's alright. There's a few fish in here that are over six pounds that will let you get the gold scale. Okay, I'm gonna go to bed, but uh, when Kirk Q is talking, explaining the game, uh, let him talk, especially since this game, this run is going to be very, very confusing, <laughs> just about um, everything. Yeah. Just come here! What is he doing, dude? I'm gonna go ahead and put the hat on. Yeah, awesome. alright. Be on the hat. So, Cosmo oh. is in the lead right now. No. Get out of here. Yeah, Cosmo's no. in the lead. Um, no. Runner guy <laughs> and Alec. Both just got the scale, just about, and Gianno is catching a fish here. I don't think he's big enough, man. <laughs> <laughs> no, he's not. <laughs> Alright, so Cosmo just grabbed a bottle. Uh, this whole game is about bottles. We'll talk a little bit more about that later. Yeah. Zelda, the adventures of bottle. Cosmo is grabbing a Degu stick for later. Cosmo is the one wearing the green hat right now. <laughs> we so. have a shout out to Electromid. Uh, Blastosis Cystosis says that you have some NA members watching and they got you back in this concert. Oh, sweet. Shout out to NA, Nintendo Age. Alright, so this is everyone's favorite cutscene with King Zora. <laughs> <laughs> Fun fact, he says Mweep 25 times. <laughs> Um, you need to come here so you can show that the, the letter to King Zora in order to get the bottle empty to use it later. I believe this cutscene as a whole takes about a minute, just about, with Mweep being about 30 seconds. Uh, question about this. Uh, is this the bottle, uh, for you to get and who goes are very random and difficult, so uh, it should be a little faster. Picard goes way out of the way for this route. Okay. Right. We there there is a route song. that you can do it that okay. way. Alright. Yeah. Yeah. That's a single segment. He needed to choose the well, uh, bomb shoes. Yeah. <laughs> Keep an eye out for those blue boxes at the end of the text. That's a 20th of a second right there. <laughs> Cosmo's going down the river. It might be faster on PC, I don't know. I'm pretty sure it is. It's Just like, it's like even though I get my 10 rupees from it. The race will give you a chance to win either a picture of Link or a picture of Link riding the phone out. Sorry, ZFG. <laughs> Feel free to win based on who you think is going to win, accordingly to their performance. Cosmo on a bad swim down Zora's River here. Oh, the N64 guys get to save warp here, which saves a little bit of time, but like we said, it sort of all evens out in the end. Alright, 
missing out on all these rupees in the in the rupees. Oh, shoot. <laughs> Sorry. I get, have you guys ever messed up the pokey escape? <laughs> Several times. <laughs> These guys are gonna escape the forest again. <laughs> I got the guy's key There we go. I got the guy's key again. Oh, nice. <laughs> Alec is in the lead out of the forest. Oh, man. Cosmo is just beasting a path to the castle right now. <laughs> Cosmo's tech skill is ridiculous. Too much, too much melee. I know Cosmo has a lot of his bottle adventure memorized, so he, yeah. he just knows what items turn into what items. So even if he screws up this run, he's gonna have an out where these guys might have to ask him for assistance. <laughs> Cosmo had a large part of finding out what it, all the RBA stuff does. So. Alright, so this is a very difficult skip. Yeah. It's not that hard. I, I, I would like some serious time just because I'm the worst at it. Oh, fuck. <laughs> yeah. Watch the F bombs, guys. Where are you going? Alright, Alec actually has a chance to catch up here. Maybe. Yeah, he said serious time. It's not random. Where am I? It's a little weird. Okay, there we go. Alright, nice run again. I did not pause. Oh, I forgot to hit my watch. What's the time at right? 745. Two for bad. That's not. The end of the I started right when you started though, so I okay. that's a good time. No, that's good. We just broke it down. It's still very close. <laughs> Alright. Oh, yes. yes. Alright, All right. everyone has successfully glitched. I'm glad it's a story. race now. <laughs> I've been stuck at I get stuck at that like eight minutes sometimes. It's really stupid. <laughs> you and John are about racing now. Cosmo still has a slight lead. So who has the advantage in the cutscene here? No, no one. No. About the same cutscene. Nothing hard to render or anything. Just a reminder, coming up next will be Giano either playing Majora's Mask or Mario 64 120 stars. Get those bids in if you'd like more Zelda goodness. It's still trailing by about $250. Mm -hmm. <laughs> if you want more of these cutscenes, <laughs> you can get those bids in to have some Mario 64 goodness. I like Breakdown's idea. Mario 64 betterness, maybe? Betterness? Yeah, betterness. betterness, that goes hard to say. Right. Oh, yes. Betterness is pretty a gromula word for all those words. 
So if you noticed, we sort of skipped all the gems as a child, so <laughs> there's still gonna be a door there when we get out of this cutscene. Oh, you were supposed to get stuff if you were a kid? Yeah, unfortunately <laughs> there's a lot more to this game than going to the temple. You might want to try playing it sometime. <laughs> <laughs> You might also notice there are six sages here. I'm not quite sure what that's about because I've just been watching these guys play. Runner guy, you have a specific challenge for Green Ride. He says $100 if you mega flip break skip. <laughs> <laughs> Anything Ring Rush says is impossible. <laughs> <laughs> uh, speaking of Majora's Mask versus Mario 64, in case you don't know, a good Majora's Mask win, that would be an any percent run, whereas Mario 64 would be a full 120 star run. We are already doing a one-star run of Mario 64 regardless. But that shows nothing of the game, so yeah. <laughs> don't worry about it. Gianna wants to play Mario 64. Gianna gets two cents in here. If you just like Bowser fights, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> Surprise, there's more cutscene. <laughs> Very masculine. <laughs> Cheek, male or female? Probably, Discuss. Probably some cool yeah. Definitely not a princess. Tough guy? Definitely wouldn't get cased in some weird crystal randomly. <laughs> 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 Could happen, never. Yeah, why well, couldn't? Well, I'm not gonna spoil this one thing. <laughs> Giano is a little bit ahead of Alec here, probably three seconds. Stay warping to get past that door that's still there. You will slow text. The classic controller message does account for part of the time that's the difference between the virtual console and the N64. So they did lose a little bit of time. So just quits eventually. <laughs> but you don't actually need the classic controller, you can play with the GameCube controller. So who's gonna be the first one to do a run on the 3DS version? <laughs> uh, I'm not getting it. Probably Cosmo. Cosmo has some faith for some reason. <laughs> oh, I had discussed this earlier, but back walking is faster than forward walking for anyone who didn't know that. You mean back pedaling? Back pedaling. Back pedaling. Back pedaling. <laughs> Same is not true for Twilight Princess. You can't do forward back. Yeah. That's what I'm Okay, so now we're going to start a chain of events that's pretty terrible and confusing, but ends up beating the game really fast. And I'll try to explain them as they go rather than telling them ahead of time. Incidentally, right here, they didn't get the long bang, or how are they always wait. supposed to have bombs as an adult that comes up? So right. I understand <laughs> putting bombs on C. So yeah, what he's, what he's saying is, when you uh, when you become an adult, they want to sort of take your items off that are like slingshot and boomerang, because you're not supposed to have those, so they just assign some default items, including bombs.